A failed tax bill led some, to some partisan bickering in the Kentucky House last week. House Bill 475 combined the desire of urban Democrats for more tax flexibility for Louisville and Lexington with Republicans' desire to cut down on city and county taxes and workers' wages and on business profits, which they say makes the state less competitive in economic development. While the legislation was expected to have enough votes to pass, many Democrats opted not to vote, including several who had signed on to the bill as co-sponsors. I believe this is a very good bill, and I think it's a bill that we need. But I am representing my caucus, even though they're individual members today, because all session long what we've heard is, you're in the super minority and you don't count. We don't need you. And you've given us, you've given us some crumbs. You've helped, you've let us be part of the process from time to time. But you know what, we do count. The last minute revolt sparked sharp words from Republicans who do hold that super majority of 62 members in the chamber. And if sponsors don't vote, co-sponsors don't vote, I see it as a breach of their honor. And I am aggrieved, Mr. Speaker. I'm aggrieved. Some of you may be proud, but I want you to know I'm ashamed. You've given your word, you've not honored it. You talk about leadership. Think about the first president of the United States. He was offered to be king, and he said no. House Speaker David Osborne says Democrats who chose to thwart the bill were more interested in scoring points than making policy. It was possible the matter would come up for another vote as we began uh, taping today. Drew, I, I understand that the Democrats are frustrated, but the reality is they are in the super minority because citizens of Kentucky have voted a majority of Republicans in office. Yeah, it's not where they want to be, but that's where they are. You can't just start protesting now and wish I could say I'm surprised by this. Uh, can we just send Republicans, Democrats on like a retreat, get everybody <laughs> back on the set, work together, maybe land between the lakes? <laughs> Marriage boot this, camp? Everything that comes up, they're holding out on votes and sabotage the other side. I know. And, and all to the detriment of us. Us, yes. So, all right, now in Hey, Kentucky, in case you missed it, a review of recent headlines. UK football is apparently planning to hire Oregon's Joven Boonight to, I don't even know if I said that right, to replace receivers coach Michael Smith. Boonight was one of the best wide receivers in college football as a senior in 2005. Following his playing career, he coached at Utah State for a decade, paving the way for a one season stint with the Ducks. Up next on Hey Kentucky, music, pets, beer. That sounds pretty good. They were all among the highlights of an annual fundraiser held in Les Lexington last week. Kathleen Smith takes us behind the scenes of Tales and Ales when we return.